This will be an example of how to calculate speech transmission index in Odeon, also called STI. And here we have a large uh, industrial hall with two machines that are modeled with surface sources. And I want to calculate the speech transmission index for a point source, um, which should be a speaking person. So I'll define this uh, point source close to one of the receivers. We can say we look at receiver number 12 and define a point source. And we have to situate it close to the receiver in order to the receiver to be able to hear anything in this noise. Um, so I'll try to move it a little closer. Uh, maybe 65. And then I will uh, point, make sure the receiver or the source is talking towards the receiver. Uh, but I have to define the directivity of the speaker and we can say this is a, a person that is talking with a raised voice and I select this directivity and uh, the sound power is uh, defined directly within this source definition. So I can use this for my calculation. So I close and save the, the source. Mm -hmm. Then I need to find out what is the background noise or the noise from the machines in the uh, in the receiver point number 12. So I take the job that is already calculated. This is a multi-point response and I can go to the energy parameters and here we have all the receivers and we have the receiver number 12 it's here and we can see what is the sound pressure level from the machines at this receiver so when I calculate STI I have to um, type in the background noise level here in the room setup under this window So I use the parameters from the multipoint response. See at 125 hertz we have 90.6. Oh, and it should not be minus 90 and 6. 250 is 82 dB I'll move it a little um, 500 is 77 alright so now, now I have uh, typed in the the background noise level, which I can use for this speech transmission index. And there's some different uh, ways of calculating it, but I'll just use the normal one. So I'll define a new job where I um, say STI and we have to Define receiver towards source, so it must be the end source in the end. Yes, we turn it on, so it's looking at the source, and we have to find receiver number twelve, and then I calculate the speech transmission index. takes a few seconds and I can see 
if I look on the energy parameters where how the STI is um, very low probably because of the large noisy machines in the industrial hall.